so now let's talk about homework number two for week three. So for this homework, we'll be revisiting the blog project and actually add the ability to make new posts. So you actually should have already added the ability to log in and log out and to make a new user. But if not, if you had some issues with that, we're actually going to give you a new stencil that has those sections included. So you can go check your work on the parts that you filled in last week and the parts that you already filled in. So for this homework, we're actually going to be adding the ability to make new posts. So right now we're logged in as the user test. So let's go up here and click on new post. All right. So, so far so good. We're on the new post page. Let's make a title of new post and entry of entry. And let's just go down here and let's submit this form. All right, so here we get an error, insert entry NYI. So that gives us a hint as to what we're actually missing. So it's actually the post request. When we try to make a new post, we need this insert entry function to actually insert the post entry into our database. So let's take a look at the code for that. So down here we have this stack trace because we're missing the insert entry function. So let's stop this. So the way you can find out what you need to implement for this project is you can just run this command and you get back posts.js line 32 homework 3.2 to do. So let's open posts.js. So we look at this file and we can see this is the posts data access object. And one of the things we do here is we save our posts equals db.collection.posts. So you can actually use this to perform operations against the post collection. So you don't actually have to use this DB object directly. So if we go down here, the get posts function, we can see an example of using it. We're using posts.find.sort and giving it some arguments. And this is just an example of using this posts object. It's equivalent to doing db.collectionPosts.find. Just wanted to show how to use that. All right, so let's take a look at what we have to implement for homework 3.2. So if we look up here, we can see we have this insert entry function. So a lot of this is done for you. We're making this post. We have the permalink and we've built this entire post object. This is complete. Now all you have to do is figure out how to insert it into the posts collection. So down here, we see our callback with the error message that we saw when we tried to open this page and tried to do this operation when we were in the browser and the stack trace we saw in the shell. So just to take a look at the surrounding code, this is the insert entry function, and basically it takes title, body, tags, author, and callback. And actually all the code to build this post and actually create this post object is all done for you. All the processing, all the sanitizing the input is done for you. So all you really need to do is figure out how to insert this post into the posts collection. So this will actually give us support for creating a new post, and this is your assignment for homework 3.2.